Hey guys, and welcome to the Chroma side of YouTube. So today I was going to do a dirty pour. I think I'm still going to, um, but I think what instead of just flipping it, I think I'm just going to pour it out. I don't know. Let's see how this goes. So I have... Six colors going on here. Where's the? Oh, okay. I have six colors going on here. Um, <clears throat> I have the PBO Studio Acrylics, which this one is orange jean iridescent. I also did my background painting with this color because I really like this color and I think it's pretty. Um, I have. So that's this one mixed up in the cup. Um, I have Cadmium Orange by uh, Dollar and Ronnie. I have Process Yellow, Dollar and Ronnie. I have um, Gold Hue, I believe that's, yeah, Golden Hue by uh, Dollar and Ronio Studio 3 Acrylics. This one I got from Walmart. Thought that was pretty interesting that they actually had Dollar and Ronnie. Um, this is the Cadmium Orange. Uh, and then I have Mars Black by Dollar and Ronnie. And then by Liquitex Basics, I have Elysian Crimson Hue. So, I kind of wanted a bright yellow, orangey painting. So, this is the one I'm going with. I don't do black in my pores very often. So, let's just see how this goes. And I'm not really going to go in any certain kind of... Um, I forgot to add silicone to some of these and I'm not going to add it to all of them so that's okay that I didn't add it to those. Oh. Guess what I just did again. I just dripped silicone on my canvas but you know what that trick that we learned um, last week with the alcohol really worked so I'm super excited to know that so there we go I hope this is enough paint to cover the canvas. Not quite sure that it is, but we'll see. Check out the cup, you guys. Love it when the cup does that. Now, for this one, my mix is one part paint to two parts Vallejo pouring medium, no water, nothing, just paint and pouring medium, and a few drops of silicone. <clears throat> so, we will see how this happens to pour. My loneliness. So I'm super excited, you guys, because guess what? I am a huge Justin Timberlake fan, and he is coming out with his next album. It will be out February 2nd, and I'm already pre-bought it. 
I couldn't help myself. I love Justin so much. He was my first and only concert. Never been to another concert before. And Future Sex Love Show was the one that I went to. And love him. Just absolutely love him. All right. I am not going to stir the cup because I don't think I need to. Should I do? Okay. I did a flip. I'm not quite sure this is going to cover the whole canvas, but we'll see. No, I really don't like this. Really, really don't like this. So, hmm. Ooh, opportunity. Super excited, okay, guys, because I just came up with something to do with this. Okay, well, I don't like this. It went muddy on me. I do like some parts of it, but I really, I just don't like it. So, I'm going to um, see what I can do. Um, time for Vallejo, because Vallejo has come to the rescue on a lot of stuff. And I'm excited to try this again. This. Okay. You know what? How am I going to do this? Let's see. Let me move this out of the way. I'm going to turn this this way. 
and I'm gonna pull it like that. Well, now that's interesting, but still not wild about it. So what am I gonna do? Hmm. Okay, let's see what to do, what to do. Let's try it again. And I'm going to make sure to push down right here. We'll wiggle it around a little bit. That's pretty cool. Let's see. Well, it's very dark, I can say that. Um, I think it could use a little lighter color, but I don't know what color. Let's see. I'm gonna play with the other one in just a few minutes because now I have two. Um, What about, well, what about white? Let's, let's try white. I mean, at this point, there's no going back, right? Plus I have a lot of, a lot of the white. I ordered like four bottles of it, so. Okay.
you know, I like this one a lot better. That's all there is to it. I like this one a lot, lot better. Like I said, it's still dark, but it's just, there's just something about it that I just, I enjoy. I love all these cells up here. I love the haphazardness down here. I, I don't know why I love this so much, but I do. I only wish these cells would have continued down here, but what can you do? Um, it's pouring and I mean... I, to me, it kind of looks like the cells are raining and then creating puddles. So, that's that. That one is there. So, now I'm going to go and put this on the dry rack. And then I'm going to pull out the one that I was just swiping with. <coughs> and I'm going to put a little bit of Vallejo paint on that one and see where I can take that one. Just take my little palette knife. And I will put it on here because I want a lot more paint than I have. You know, waste not, want not, right? Okay. Now, I'm just going to try and smooth out this paint here. Ice my cake a little bit. Okay. Let's do unbleached titanium. Yes. Unbleached titanium. And then a little bit of raw umber. This kind of matches what's on the canvas right now because we already made brown. Might as well add brown to it, right? And now let's go into teal. And a little bit of thylo cyan thylo thylo cayenne green. Hope I didn't butcher that word again. I feel like I'm always butchering that poor word. All right, I'm gonna wipe off my palette knife. Really good. There we go. Move this guy out of the way for right now. And then I'm just going to pull this paint down. Cups are in the way. Okay, let's torch it, see how we like it. This is the torch that doesn't have barely anything in it.
Okay, so I really, 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 really love this one. For a painting that is right off the cuff with barely any paint left, I have to say that I absolutely thoroughly love this one. I wish that I was covering the sides with the leftover paint that I had on the palette knife. I love it so much. It's so pretty. Love this spot. Love that spot. There's so many different types of cells in here. You know, I'm starting to really, 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 really love Vallejo paint. <laughs> I don't know why. There's like really no rhyme or reason, but I really do enjoy that about it. And also the colors are really amazing together. I'm going to bring you guys down, let you guys have a look. There are some places in here I'm going to end up going and touching up with my paintbrush, but you've got to see these. They're so amazing. So, as you can see right there where the red is, I'm definitely going to be going through and touching that part up, but look at these cells. They are amazing. I'm going to pull you guys over this way. Love these cells. This right here is my favorite part. The brown, the burnt sienna, the teal, it's beautiful. It looks crackle. I love it. Love the dark. I, I don't even know where dark blue came from, but it's in there, and I love it. Um, Moving up this way, all this teal and that dark area. Beautiful. These cells are gorgeous. And then we're going to go over here into this titanium, unbleached titanium. And those blue veins running through there, perfect. So, this goes to show, as I've shown you for the past two or three weeks, um, just because you think a painting is ruined, doesn't mean that you should stop and rinse it off and try again. You can always continue to work with it and get it the way you like it. This is going to be one of my all-time favorites. I can already tell you this is hanging up in my house because I absolutely love these color combinations. And I'm going to try and recreate them. I don't know if I will be able to, but I'm going to try. Um, I hope you guys were inspired. If you like what I do, please give me a thumbs up. Hit subscribe and ring the bell for notifications when I put up new videos. Have a wonderful day, y'all. And please, be inspired. Hey, thank you so much for stopping by. If you enjoyed what you just watched, please hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up for a like and hit the bell. That'll give you notifications when I post new videos. I really enjoyed painting today and I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope you will get inspired to do all types of things. <laughs> Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye, y'all.